Good morning, Commissioners. Brian Massey, 8196 uh, Rainbow Drive. Um, I've learned, uh, I think, some disturbing uh, facts. I, I haven't had a chance to uh, offer, uh, get uh, public records requests, so I thought I would come before the uh, Commissioners and ask if you have any knowledge about what I'm about to tell you. About five years ago, when we started uh, our activism, you know, we looked at the uh, Lake County Port Authority and the Visitors Bureau, and at that time, I was, I, I was really uh, surprised that the leaders at that time of those two organizations did not even, you know, live in Lake County. So I, I thought it was a bit hypocritical for those two organizations trying to bring people in, and the the ones running the show didn't even live in the county. Well, something uh, similar to that has uh, has come up, has been uh, brought to my attention by a couple of anonymous uh, sources, and it has to deal with uh, Lakeland Community College. Um, there is a gentleman by the name of Ryan Callender, who I understand is the uh, president of the Board of Trustees of Lakeland Community College, um, and I believe he was one of three that was appointed by the commissioners. I don't know if he was appointed by you three commissioners or uh, prior commissioners. Uh, at that time that he was appointed, he did live in Lake County. But as I understand now, he now lives in Cuyahoga County. Now, why is that important? I, I'm not saying that everybody that uh, you know, works in Lake County uh, you should um, live in Lake County. That's, that's not what I am uh, I'm su suggesting. Uh, I know Mike Matus doesn't live in Lake County, and I want to make sure the commissioners keep Mike Matus in Lake County. Uh, I just feel uh, I'm a big supporter of Mike Matus. So that's not the intent trying to say everybody that uh, works here should live here. However, Mr. Callender, in his position, has uh, you know, quite a bit of authority, and it has to uh, deal with uh, Mr. Morris Beveridge the uh, president of, uh, as I understand, of uh, uh, Lakeland Community College. Uh, Mr. Beveridge, as I, I was told, is about to have his five-year contract expire. And uh, as part of that contract, I was told that he has a uh, $100,000 bonus that he will be paid at the end of that contract. And I was told that uh, Mr. Beveridge is looking for another five-year contract. And uh, he is also asking for, he originally asked for a $500,000 bonus at the end of that five year, but he is now looking for, uh, he will accept a $300,000 bonus payment at the end of that five year contract. Now, I'm not suggesting that Mr. Beveridge is not uh, you know, worthy of that at all, uh, but my point is that people that are making that kind of decision, I know that I'm, everybody that's living in Lake County is paying property taxes for Lakeland Community College. I would just like those that are making the decision to spend the money, they have some skin in the game also. So I'm, I'm asking the commissioners um, if what I have said here, is it correct, or should I go uh, through the public records request, you know, with Lakeland Community College? Have I made myself clear on that issue? I would say yes. I'm looking to legal, but I have, I, I don't know quite how to respond to well, that. Well, I guess I can, you certainly can make a public records request to Lakeland Community College. Mm-hmm. Yes, I. Uh, yes, I used to make them to Amy Sabbath, but I now have to make it through the uh, uh, through their attorney, and we'll we'll certainly do that. But I I just wondered if the uh, commissioners, because you're, you know, you do. Uh, first of all, I, I yeah. did you appoint uh, Mr. Calendar to that position? We did he? Did I'm looking over to Jen. That was in that most recent round of. Yeah, I would have to look. I don't know it off the top of my head. Oh, okay. All right. Out. That, okay. That is my recollection. I believe he is their board president. You may have said that. I don't recall. Yes. Yes. Uh, okay. Then I then uh, if you uh, don't have anything to any wisdom to impart on that, I will ask for a public records request and, and let the people know. What are the specific items you'd be requesting again? 
There were no I, I, I'm confirming that um, the uh, he is uh, his current five-year contract is about to expire. He will receive one hundred thousand dollars as a bonus payment, which was part, I would assume, of the original contract that he signed. Uh, then he is looking for a second, or he's looking for an additional five-year contract, and that uh, additional five-year contract will include a lump sum bonus payment of three hundred thousand dollars at the termination of that contract. And I'm also, I also want to confirm that, excuse me, Commissioner Young, I also want to confirm that Mr. Callender is no longer a resident of Lake County, but he serves as president of the Lakeland Community County Co Community College Board. Okay. And right. you're, you're concerned that the president then would be a resident? Well, the, 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 well, the, you want their skin in the game. Yeah, yeah. I, I, again, I, I guess it's a personal uh, uh, observation or opinion that he's making a decision of spending some significant dollars with no skin in the game if he's not paying property taxes to Lakeland being a Lake County resident. Why would that extend to uh, board members? That's just, again, that's a personal opinion of mine that uh, uh, he uh, he's not he's not paying any taxes, but he's willing to you know spend our money. Thank you very much. Quick question for you. Yes, sir. We can maybe talk offline, but you said at the termination of the contract, the five-year contract, three hundred thousand. Is it your understanding that if the contract gets terminated before the five years, there's a three hundred thousand dollar penalty? As I understand it, was at the conclusion. I, I, I don't have uh, you know the details of uh, uh, what happens if he terminates after two years. Does he still get the money? I, I can't really address that. My understanding was just at the end of the five-year contract, uh, he was looking for five hundred, but would settle for three. Okay. okay. All right. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much.